Hello and welcome to GoTech. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Under Armour Headphones Wireless, engineered by JBL. The Under Armour Headphones Wireless costs $180. As of this video, they are on sale for $150. They can be found at major retailers like Dick Sporting Goods, Target, or at JBL or Under Armour website. I will leave a link below to where you can purchase them. In my opinion, I believe that these are a little overpriced, as other top of the line wireless headphones are available, like the Jaybird X series and the Bose Sound Sport series. I have really enjoyed using these as my daily driver as my working out headphones. Keep in mind that I am not an audiophile and that these are for regular music listeners. These are great. When having a good pair of working out headphones, things that I look forward to is that they're loud, they're clear, and have a lot of good bass to them to get me pumped while working out. These deliver in all these aspects. When turned all the way up, you can clearly hear the bass in the instrument. These headphones do have a very deep and rich bass to them. The vocals are okay, but they could have been better especially for the $180 price tag that, they, that these have. Genres that shine are EDM, hip hop, rock, and pop. Features that the Under Armour headphones wireless have is an in hour battery life. In my own experience, they last about six hours if you have the volume at about 80%. Leaving the volume at 50%, they last me seven hours and 47 minutes. These are very close to the claim that Under Armour makes of eight hours. Charging these is easy. It uses a micro USB charger and it took one hour and 31 minutes for it to charge. One of the disappointments for me was that it did not display the battery life. Instead, they will interrupt your music to tell you it was low on battery, which is annoying while working out. One of the features that I did find helpful was that if the headphones were not being used, they will automatically power off. This is a feature that I wish all wireless headphones had. Bluetooth connectivity was easy and flawless every time. What I did have much trouble with is that I did not have much range to the wireless headphones. I could only get about 15 feet away from the device before I started to lose connectivity. Another feature that these have is a twist lock technology that holds the headphones in place in the ear canal. The twist lock holds very well. It rarely fell out while lifting. When I was running after about two miles or so, I did have to readjust them due to it losing suction due to sweat in my ear canal. I was very pleased overall because for the most part, they did not need any adjustment. Unlike my Jabba Rock, which always used to fall out while lifting a set. These headphones measure at 20 inches long and are very light and compact, coming in at 0.4 ounces. Other features are included as a 12 month premium membership to Map My Fitness app, both which are in the Google Play Store and the Apple Store. These services usually cost $9.99 monthly or $49.99 per year. Getting it for 12 months is a good extra bonus. In addition, the headphones come with two set of ear tips, large and small. Also, it comes with a silicon rubber carrying case. This case is good to hold your headphones, but do not provide any protection to the headphones. For a premium price of $180, I did expect to get a better carrying case. These headphones have a very rugged feel to them. The cable construction is solid and it seems as they will last a long time. Being sports headphones, these headphones are sweat proof. These headphones do feature a three button and mic feature. The three buttons are volume up, down, pause, and play. All which work very well. The person at the other end did not experience any trouble hearing me while using these headphones. This is my review of the Under Armour headphones wireless engineered by JBL. I will leave a link below where you can purchase these. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to drop a comment and don't forget to click the subscribe button as we have new content coming on soon. Thank you. Until next time, this is Good Tech.